Good morning, everybody. So we started this new thing with the kids where we have these, um, I call it the family chart of fun, where it's essentially different tasks that they can do um, to help us out here on the farm. And they have ran with it this morning. It's fantastic. They've already collected eggs and, you know, made their beds and all these other types of things. Maybe I'll show you that chart. It's inside. One thing I'm going to do, though, right now, is I have been um, training up Elsie a little bit, our milk cow. I've been training her up just a bit so that we can start milking her. Watch this. She's ready. Sometimes she moves. So I'm going to get some grain, and then I can um, show you how I've been just milking her just a little bit. I don't have the milking uh, stanchion up. And listen to the choir in here. Well, look, there's already an egg over there. It's like an Easter egg hunt every time I come in here. <laughs> Let me get the grain. Hey, Mr. Sun. You doing okay? <laughs> <laughs> the fan club is pretty awesome. Oh, did you hear? Did you hear? I got her grain. Let me let me give her another call. Look at that Billy Bob. Look at her lick her lips. She's ready. Okay. Let me go in there and I'll take it to her. Remember from that previous video? Oh, look, she's ready for me. She's ready for me. Oh, these chickens, they like the feet as well. <laughs> She's ready for me. Once I get that milking stanchion up, I'm going to start, um... Hey, girl. Yeah, girl, you doing good? Once I get that milking stanchion up, then um, I'm going to start feeding her in that, so that way she can get used to it. Okay, so then I'm just going to kind of rub her down. Yeah, girl. You doing okay? <laughs> and then, I'm just going to give her a couple quick, um, quick little squirts to see if I can... There we go. Can you see that? And that one's a good one. Oh, look at that one. Can you see that? Oh, here. Don't go anywhere. It's just me, girl. It's just me. Here, she's trying to get the chickens away. Here, let me try on this side. Let me try on this side. Hey girl, it's me, you're doing good. Get away chickens, get away. You're doing good, let me check. Let me just check. No, don't go anywhere. Hey Elsie, it's me, okay? It's me. She keeps moving on us. Well, that's a good one. Wow! That's a good stream back there. Yeah! Wow! Did you see that miracle? We got some milk coming. Thank you, Elsie. Chickens. Can you believe it? We have a milk cow on the farm. Finding Freedom Farm has their very own milk cow. 
We have several others as well, but this one I think is not going to be too hard to train. And she's like almost 40% Jersey. And so it's going to be awesome. She's very docile like a uh, Dexter. And then she's, uh, I mean, check this out. See how patient she is with these chickens? And with me. I mean, I can just go up to her. Pet her. Good girl. Good girl. Let me see. Let me show you Billy Bob. Hey, cute boy. Come here, Billy Bob. I haven't figured out the whole calf sharing thing yet, so I'm gonna need to um, figure out how to take him and put him um, somewhere else at night, so that way in the morning when I come out and do this, then she is ready to, uh, she's super full and ready for me to milk her, so we can have all that milk. <laughs> Everyone that we talk to that says that we ask advice about milk cows that used to own dairies and stuff, they say, don't do it, don't do it. We'll find out. Sometimes we have to learn the hard way, right? But we'll find out. I'll show you a little bit later on today about setting up the milking, um, they call it a milking stanchion. I'm still trying to wrap my brain around why it's called a stanchion. If you know, please put it in the comments. And I'll read it in the comment because I think that would be cool to know. Um... I'm going to call it a milking stand. Okay, Mr. Sun. Okay, Mr. Sun. <laughs> He's a fun, fun chicken. Um, look at Prickle. Hey, Prickle. How are you doing? You having a good morning? Did you have a good hunting night last night? Good animals on the farm. Good animals on the farm. That's what you need. You don't... No need to have bad stuff in your life. So if an animal is giving you trouble, find a new home for it. Thank you for taking care of that. Those are beautiful. They just they just came up this year, didn't they? So I got a bunch of uh, helpers now, and we're gonna go and set up that milking state. Um, keep thinking station, milking stanchion. Maybe a stanchion is different than a station because a stanchion. You like put some walls and a little thing to lock her head in there and that sort of stuff. I don't know. We'll see. We're going to set up that milking stanchion. Okay, kids, this is what I need. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Okay, so you're going to ride on the trailer. I want you to tell me if the wheel wheel gets close to hitting any of these posts. The where those wheels are on the trailer. Good question. So see this post right here? I want you to tell me if it's going to hit that on the other side as well. So I need one of you on that corner and one of you on that corner. And I'm going to go real nice and crazy fast. So that way, that way it's more of an adventure for you. So the goal, Phoebe and Alice and James, is I need one of you to lift that side and one of you to lift that side, and I'm going to lift that side, and then we're going to carry it down. I think you can. Have faith. Hey, Phoebe, can you hold, pick up that side? And James, here. James, if you pick it up right here in the middle, then you all can do this. Nelly, I need you to stay right here so you don't get hurt. Nelly, can you stay right there? Okay, you ready? One, two, three, lift. Okay, now we're going to walk down there. Be careful walking backwards. Great job, team. Okay, now we're going to walk towards the watering trough. Walk towards the watering trough. So this is where um, she's going to be standing. Yeah, okay, now towards, uh, towards the um, um, lean-to, the bar and the wall there. Okay, perfect. Set it down. 
Is it on you? No. Oh man, are you okay? Yeah. Great job. Now we're gonna need to move this so we can put it in proper place. But then it goes like this. It's on dad. It's on dad. It is? Make sure it goes the reverse way. Okay, maybe we should have another board. It looks like that. Right here. Yeah, so what you do is you put a... We're going to make a little platform right here. Yeah, give us a demo, Phoebe. So here, stick your head in again. And then this closes up along around the cow's neck. Closes up like this. And so then we're going to have a tray, like a little bowl or something right there, for the cow to stick her neck down on there and then eat from. Sure. Look at her over there. She's like throwing dust up on her. That's interesting. Um, yeah, you can go out. Thank you all for your help. So I'm going to go and get some screws, and I'm going to attach all this together. You want to help me with that, buddy? Okay, we're going to need to move this trailer out. Thank you all for your help. Hey, Nelly. 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 Nelly, look up here. Thank you for your help. Yeah, so here's our new milking stanchion. Yes, please do. Hey, let's try and scoot it. I can't really see where the... Let's do this. Let's see if this one will go through. There we go. Here's this one. Let me see if I can get it through now. There we go. There we go. Which boards? Oh, those are extra boards we have from something else. So we've got some bolts in there just to kind of hold it and these little bracings right here. And I think. To make this successful, at least with this cow, we should put some boards from here all the way back to kind of hold the cow in because she might start to wander. But yeah, let me just screw these in. Now that we have the stanchion supported, braced, and attached, we need like a little shelf here to um, put a bucket of food or something on. So that way, Elsie, when she comes up here, I mean, we have to lure her up with something. So I found some scrap pieces of wood. So thinking something like this. Something like this, whatever it is to make it level, and then I'll just screw it in. You know, it's similar to, similar to life. We rarely ever do anything without a lure, some kind of a... Not really, I mean, sometimes it's a trap, but something that entices us. Could be something good or bad. Like, let's take, for instance, your job. They entice you with a raise. Or, additional responsibility, and maybe not a raise right now, but maybe in the future. It's hard to tell. Um, however, they, uh, they entice you somehow, and then, once they entice you to do something, and then you start doing it, 
the carrot may go away or the carrot may still be there like we're legit gonna give her we're legit gonna give her some grain which is a benefit to her she likes it she likes the grain she'll come up here you want to come and try and eat out of the bowl? Come on. I'll put something yummy in it. Like some grass. So there we have it. We've got our milking station stanchion thing set up. Um, we need something to put above, um, above these, uh, I don't know what the technical term is, but we'll call them head bars. These head bars right here. So after it closes, we need something to go in here to lock this in place. We'll figure that out. So it'll lock her, her head in here while she's eating. And then we'll be able to in theory, of course, just milk her and she's gonna be super happy to let us. This morning, there wasn't a problem with me milking her and there wasn't a stanchion at all. But we're gonna leave this up. We're gonna probably, we'll go and let her be curious around it. And then uh, we'll test it out in the morning.